Hello everybody, this is going to be a demo of the Load Wallet. So I will be sharing with you how to open a new Load account. First, go to loadwallet.com in your Chrome browser preferably, but you can use Brave, Edge, Safari and others. We like to use Chrome because it seems to be more stable. So you're going to click on the button Sign In. If you already have a wallet or create a new wallet if you are a new user. Let's create a new wallet by clicking on the button. Now you're going to complete the information. I'm going to type my short login version. I'm going to use um, my load email for this purpose. Country, Canada. Okay, I'm going to choose New Brunswick. The password. You're going to use at least eight characters, uppercases, lowercases, and special characters. Once you do that, then you can continue. Password don't match. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's do that again. Continue. Then I should receive a verification code in my email. I'm going to open my email and I'm going to show you what it looks like. It looks like this. You have your email and you have a code. Copy this code and then you're going to paste it here. and continue. Now you're going to read and scroll all the way down to the terms of use for the load wallet. Click accept when you go to the bottom. Otherwise, the button could not be active. So you have to scroll down all the way to the bottom to make sure that the button is active. If you're not scrolling, it is not active. Okay, accept. Now you're going to set up a wallet pin. And confirm. Congratulations, your account is registered. We're going to skip this step and uh, go to the vault. Now this is the home uh, section in the wallet. You're going to activate your vault for the first time. So in this case, uh, you're going to be provided with 12 words that is going to be your recovery phrase. It's very important that you save these words and keep them in a safe place because if you lose these words then you will not be able to access your assets. So uh, please make sure that you write down and take the precautions to save your words in a secure place. Load will not be able to help you if you lose these 12 words. You click on got it. Then you're going to set up a new wallet as a new user or restore a wallet if you have one. In this case, set up a new wallet. These are the 12 words that you will notice that they have, they are all in lower cases. They are numbered from one to 12 and you have to write them down with the corresponding number right there. So, and then once you do that, you're going to click on, I have safely stored my recover phrase offline. Do not take screenshots or any digital way of preserving the words in your device. You are going to write them down in a piece of paper or print them, laminate them and store them in your safe or give it to your executor or lawyer or family member or any way you can retrieve these words later if for whatever reason you lose your device or you want to pass on your assets to somebody else then those are the keywords to access your wallet okay so in this case what we're going to do we're going to um, confirm that those words have been safely kept and we're going to do that Now we're going to click continue and then number 
word number one, two, we have been provided, we have to confirm number three, which is title. Now we're going to confirm the word number five, which is supreme. The next word to confirm is catalog. And the last one is essay. Now we confirm. And by entering our PIN. And now our wallet has been activated. Now we can go and buy, send, receive, swap, vest assets in the wallet. So let's explore the wallet. You have your vault assets. We have uh, digital gold, digital silver, the governance tokens, AVAX. It's important that you acquire some AVAX right from the start because you will be needing AVAX, AVAX as gas to execute any transaction. You can store Bitcoin and Ethereum, save and send. And there are other tokens that you will be able to store in there. Now let's go to the process of buying. Let's buy some Avalanche first. You click on Avalanche, then click on credit or debit card. Use Singularity. And uh, your wallet is connected, so you will be able to buy, let's say, one AVAX. And you must purchase at least five AVAX in this case. Okay, let's enter five. But we are going to be uh, reducing this limit. So it will be a minimum of $50. So click Submit Order. Okay, now you're going to select which transaction provider you are going to choose. You can use MoonPay or Transact, and each one of them gives you uh, five AVAX for a slightly different amount. So choose the one that costs you less if you want to. Click there, proceed to pay. And the ones you're here, you're going to say, I'm going to pay 187 Canadian dollars. You're going to use a Visa card and you're going to receive an estimate of 5.02 AVAX coins and you're going to click buy now. You're going to enter your email and if this is the place where you're going to, uh, uh, if it's the first time that you buy with MoonPay, you're going to be uh, directed to a KYC. You will be uploading your driver license, a proof of ID and then finish the transaction very straightforward. Once you complete that, you will be seeing your AVAX landing in your vault. So we go here. You will see your AVAX arriving here. Okay. So that's how you uh, activate a new account and how you acquire the first AVAX to operate your wallet.